Hi, I'm Bridget. You're watching TV Squad Daily. It is so fall today. Some people live in a place where they never get to hear that leaf crunchy noise. It's kind of sad. Unless their palm tree dies and all the fronds fall off and they walk on that. But that would be really sad. So last week, in the midst of all the awesome randomness, Joe says, Super random day is always on Friday. How can it be random? Joe, why you gotta be like that? You wanna get all logical? Let's do it. You called it Super Random Day, but it's Super Random Friday, and the name is very important to the definition. It has to be fair to contain the random to just one day, otherwise it'd be Super Random TV Squad Daily, and by your logic, it'd be Super Random Whole Internet. So think of Friday as a convenient kind of sausage casing for all the randomness to be held inside of. Ew. Super. Random. Friday. The strike is here. Last night, the Writers Guild decided they would go on strike. Looking like it'll probably actually start on Monday. When it's time to strike, they will all be notified simultaneously via email. That's kind of underwhelming, right? I was hoping for some kind of a beacon, but people don't really do those anymore. Oh, and they picked the new Knight Rider. It's a timeless story of a man and his talking car. And they chose Justin Bruning from the appropriately cheesy soap opera roots of All My Children to fill David Hasselhoff's shoes in the upcoming TV movie version of Knight Rider. And if this TV movie goes well, it'll become a whole TV series. And finally today, Stephen Colbert's run for president seems to be over already because he was unable to get on the Democratic primary ballot in South Carolina and didn't even try to do it on the Republican one before the deadline. And even though he filed all the necessary paperwork, an executive council voted against letting him on the Democratic ballot. They said it seemed like he was using South Carolina Democrats as suckers to further his own comedy routine. Have a good weekend. Don't forget to set your clocks back. I'll see you Monday.